Okay, sorry about that. Ow. Don't shoot me. So, um... If he is behind cover, and you shoot a bee thingy... Ah! God. Take lead angles. Where is he? Oh, he's reloading. Where is he? Oh, if you, um... Calm down, buddy. Please. I think he's behind there. <laughs> and I missed. He wasn't there. He's in the like background apparently. Okay, there he is. Right. There we go. And I don't think you can hit him twice. That's something that sucks. Right. Oh, I, why am I sucking so hard? Ah. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let me get that bullet out of my body. Get a bullet out of my body. Don't want to die from the bullet in my body. Alright. Ow! Oh, I gotta put on my life medicine before I die. Put on my life medicine before I die. Put on my life medicine before I die. Don't get to worry, Mr. Rawr. Okay. Hey. Oh, come on. Really? I'm gonna run out of ammo for this gun soon. Where is he? Amazing! Okay, uh, I'm gonna throw a stun grenade at him. No, not M19. Did that stun him a little bit? I think it hit him, yeah. It hurt him. Stop freaking getting mad at me, Ocelot soldiers! Ow! <laughs> yeah. Ow! Okay, I'm gonna go up here. Maybe I'll get an advantage on him. Okay, let's go stun grenade again. Ah! Ow! He noticed me. Oh, that sucks. Okay, bullets, and bullets, or grenade, I guess. Ow. How does he do that? He's so slick. Wait, is that a, a bunny? I love bunnies. Come here, bunny. I love you. Give me you. Give me your body. I got a rabbit. Hey, you, you, you shot a bee thingy. Hey, I see you. What are you doing? That's gross. Don't do that in the middle of battle. I shot his hat off! Awesome! I love that. Hey, don't shoot at me. Cheaters. Wait. Okay. I can't get a shot on him from up here, apparently. Oh, see, he's ricocheting his bullets now. He's so low on stamina. Hey! Put that hat back down. Yeah. Ah. Ah. I keep missing all the time. But I suck at this game. Stop ricocheting your bullets, man. I don't get to ricochet my bullets. Ow! God! Wait, yeah. Okay, for a second I thought I was using the other. Uh, wait, what? Okay, that's a little fast. He doesn't usually reload that fast. Oh. That one I love it. Okay. Okay, we're about to die. Whoa. Do I have another stun grenade? I'm gonna finish this off with a stun grenade. I can't see! Oh, I could use L1 to cheat and like... Ow. How did you hit me from the back? That doesn't make sense. Okay, cutscene time. Hooray.
That was aggravatingly what? bees. Damn it! And your guns aren't in, like engraved anymore. Uh oh, bees! Da da da! Yes, he's hitting. You see that right, folks? He is hitting bees with his revolvers. You cannot get any cooler than that. You know, unless you were like, oh god, good lord, his face is disgusting. And also, by the way, that is the only time you'll see the face of an ocelot soldier. Of course, it is a bit deformed, but it's a soldier's face after all. They're very disgusting. I really hope my recording doesn't mess up, like, seriously. I would suck. There's occasionally bees on the screen, like, the latch onto the screen, which is kind of cool. Killing bees by throwing my revolvers around. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I'm putting them away so I can run. We'll meet again. Yeah, we'll meet again like 20 times. He's basically the antagonist of the game. Yeah, research cave. Okay, so now it is completely dark. We don't know what we're doing, so we're gonna save here. And saving the game, saving the game snake. snake. No, I just came to talk to you. Snake, have you seen 007 from Russia with Love? Nah, I don't like those movies. Real spies are nothing like James Bond. It's pure fantasy. Snake, I don't think the major's going to like you saying that. And even though it's fiction, I can't help but comparing myself to Bond. What exactly don't you like about James Bond? I mean, is it the fantastic gadgets, the cars, the guns? Major. Snake, wouldn't you like to have a gun shaped like a pen? What good is a pen going to do me in the jungle? I'd look like a fool. Then what about a snake-shaped gun? You could make it look like you're grappling with a giant snake and then get a shot in on the enemy while they're distracted. <laughs> okay, now you're being ridiculous. We'll make you a snake-shaped gun that folds up and fits into an attaché case. Will you give it a rest? Oh, I get it. You're worried about how to handle the ladies, aren't you? No. I knew it. Hm, to tell you the truth, I don't like the idea of playing hanky-panky with enemy femme fatales either. But that's part of Bond's appeal. You could learn a thing or two from him. I mean, what about this Eva? What are you planning to do with her? I... I, I don't even trust her yet. No, that's not what I mean. You, you can't let yourself get involved. This is a game of spy versus spy. She's using you just as much as you're using her. I realize that. You've got to grab the initiative, and to do that, you have to get the upper hand in the relationship. That's what a spy is supposed to do. Get the upper hand? I don't think I'm cut out for that mission. Maybe if you change your code name to 00 Snake. Major. 007 is the biggest thing to come out of England since the Mayflower. I wouldn't be surprised if they made 20 more of those movies. Didn't you know? The Major is a huge James Bond fan. Don't get him worked up like this. Worked up? Maybe you don't realize this, but now that you've got him started talking about Bond, I'm going to have to listen to him lecture for a whole hour after he gets off the radio. You have my sympathy. It's too bad you can't enjoy such a great movie, though. I guess I'm just one of those people who can't enjoy spy flicks. Well, that was an interesting code of call. I guess I'll see you guys next time when we will figure out where the hell we are. See you guys next time.